<sighs> okay, so today's a bad day. <laughs> today is a bad day. I feel like shit. Look at my pink one. Ah, oh, fuck it. No one gives a shit about me. No one gives a shit about me. I feel so alone. So, what the hell, I'll just make a video, right? <laughs> I'll make a video. It's my only source of comfort. Because I can't uh, reach people. Because they don't want to respond. <laughs> oh, far out. Oh. Hmm. I feel horrible. I feel so horrible. I don't feel like being by myself. Because then I'll start ruminating and, uh... Oh, that's so bad. That is bad. I don't care if anyone watches this video, I don't. I'm making this just for myself. I'm talking to a wall. I'm talking into the ether. All my words are going into the ether. Is there someone out there? Is there someone out there who hears? Who hears me? Are my words just going out into the ether? Is there someone out there? I don't know, I'm so confused. Like, I don't know who watches my videos, who doesn't. Are you watching my videos? Yes, you. Are you watching my videos? Let me know. Oh, it seems kind of cruel not to let me know. It seems kind of cruel. It hurts. I don't feel too good. I'm writing it as a stupid journal. Look, I have a journal. I'm not going to show you what I write. That's just for me. That's just for me. No one gets to read my journal. No. Yes. Practically no one. Because into my journal, I write stuff no one gets to read because. Even these vlogs, I mean, yes, they're kind of open, but my channel is just for me. Mostly. Like I said, I'm just on this video because I just don't want to be by myself. So I'm not really going to be doing anything. 
Not that anyone watches. <laughs> well, some people watch, but I just don't know who these people are. So it's like, mm. why do you, why do people even watch my videos? It's like, what do you get out of it? What do you get out of watching my videos? You get something out of it? Maybe you do. I don't know. Maybe I should have gone and to meet my friend. It would have been better. Staying at home was probably not a good idea. Just didn't feel too good. Maybe I should just talk to her. Maybe I don't talk. But I could talk to her. Well, I don't know, it's, it's not to say, like, in this video, it's, I feel like talking to this camera is much more open and freeing than talking to any human being. Because <laughs> when I'm talking to a human being, you're always like, you know, it's not, it's not that free. I, I don't feel that free to express myself, whereas... Uh, Whereas when I'm talking to this camera, I feel like I can just be myself. I don't have to worry about what anyone really thinks. Well, for the most part, but... Yeah, it's like I can just talk. I don't have to... Like, talk to a person. <laughs> well, I'm gonna title this video... Oh, cruel world, why hast thou abandoned me? <laughs> or, um... An idiot. Am I an idiot for reaching out? I don't know if I'm an idiot, but I'm certainly exposing myself to pain. Maybe reach out to people. That's what you do. You make yourself vulnerable. Getting hurt. I don't like getting hurt. I'm not a I'm not a masochist. I'm, I don't I don't like getting hurt. I don't blame you. I don't blame you for my actions. If I reach out to somebody and there is no reciprocity. I don't blame them. I reached out. I took the chance. I took the chance. I reached out. So like, how can I blame someone else? That's not right, is it? <sighs> Maybe I'll just title this video, Feeling Abandoned lost and confused <laughs> again uh, feeling I'll write that down here abandoned lost and confused so it's about like a 1 p.m. ish uh, the day before my birthday uh, I was going to like not, I was going to stop making videos and uh, then it's like, oh fuck it, <laughs> I think I will die. I think I would die if I don't make videos because I won't have a place in which to express myself and if I cannot express myself, I think the pain will kill me. Like before I made this video, I was feeling so much pain. Uh, well, you know. 
as humans feel. <laughs> I'm not saying my pain is so special, but um, it's special to me. Uh, but yeah, so after making this video, I feel a bit better. I feel a bit better right now. I feel, I feel. Needing to be heard is such an important thing. So I know I was saying like, you know, are my, are my words just going out into the ether? Is there someone out there? You know that Pink Floyd song? Is there someone out there? I don't know what that means, but... Needing to be heard is so important. Needing to be heard is the difference between life and death or life and no life not necessarily death but life and no life it's like you're alive but you're not really alive so um i'll write that down too needing to be heard is so important uh, it can be the difference between living and not living. Yes. Uh, so yeah, um, I have to make videos because it seems like that's the only. It's my lifeline. You know how people have a lifeline. I'll write that down. <laughs> Making videos is a lifeline, or uh, YouTube is a my lifeline. Making videos is a life line YouTube YouTube is my life line without it I would be I don't know distraught right now Uh, I would be distraught. Uh, I bought some uh, Kindle books. It's about um, well, trans people and because uh, I'm a trans person, obviously. Um, and my, uh, it's like, how does a trans person have relationships with other people? You know, so I bought these two because it, anyway, I was listening to this um this guy. I think he's a gay man, but he makes he has this playlist on trans issues. It's a, uh, I'll link the playlist. His name is something, and he mentioned in one of the videos a book called Trans Love or something. So I I put that in Amazon and I came up on this book, Trans Love or something. So I bought that book and. Uh, a related book what was about trans bodies or something so this is, I think this would be interesting because that's definitely aimed for trans people like how do I get into a relationship with another person who may be trans who may not be trans uh, gender I mean sexual orientation and what sort of gender I mean I'm not really into the whole gender thing like I would be someone who's like a a pansexual uh, a pansexual means someone who can fall in love with or be attracted to another person irrespective of gender or um, yeah 
So like it's it's not the, the bisexual is a person who is attracted to either a man or a woman, but a pansexual is attracted to man, woman, transgender, gender non-conforming. So a pansexual encompasses more than just the binary. So I'll, I'll link those below. I, I mean, you know, I've got all these books, but uh, just have to find the time to read them. But I'm just like so. I'm really, you know, kind of distraught and messed up. But I feel much better right now after making this video. So this video saved me again. YouTube saved me. Thank you, YouTube. You saved me. Thank you, YouTube. Oh, well, you know, if anyone watches my videos, I feel like I'm being heard. Even, but if people don't watch well, at least I put my voice out there and it's there if people want to listen or see at least it's out there for people to listen and see uh, anyway. yeah.